Michigan, a student is being recognized for his commitment to justice. News 8's Dana White joins us now with what he's been doing. Dana. Casey and Teresa, Isaiah Reynolds attends West Ottawa High School in Holland. Last summer, he shared some of his experiences during the city's Black Lives Matter rally. He's now being recognized and wants others to follow in his footsteps and share a message of unity. Using his voice to bring people together. We get lost in our own perception and, and caught up in our own and what we think. I can't hear you. During a time when many felt far apart. And we don't think about what others are going through. That's why Isaiah Reynolds says he spoke last summer at Holland's Black Lives Matter rally. As an African-American man, young man, I was, there was no question that I wanted to do it. It is my honor to present this year's... His words were so impactful, the city gave him its Youth Social Justice Award, recognizing his commitment to change. But his words stem from experience. He rolled his window down and said, hey, expletive, and I'm sure maybe people can think of what that word was. When I heard that, like, like I, I, it, like I was woke, I woke up, like, this is, this is how I'm going to be viewed in society if, just, just, be, just based on the color of my skin. Just as a human being, um, just listening to Isaiah's testimony, it, it hurts. Jason uh, Reinecke you know, is the like, principal at West Ottawa High School, Reynolds School. He says he hopes Reynolds' story motivates others. Part of my role in this, I haven't experienced those things, but I need to be a part of the change. I think it sets, sends a message to other students that you can use your voice. Reynolds saying he wants people to continue having tough conversations and ultimately during hateful times to choose love. Without love, we're not going to go anywhere. Reynolds adds that while he's very grateful for the award, the biggest reward for him is knowing he can continue talking about these issues, ultimately making a difference. Live in studio this morning, Dana White, News 8.